it's Miss Stacy from the Mind of Berlin Library back to read another story with you today. But first, will you sing with me and say hello to all of our friends? Are you ready? Hello, friends. Hello, friends. Hello, friends. It's time to say hello. Hi, everyone. <laughs> well, I have a fun book to share with you today, my friends. Let's see who's going to get on our bus. Are you ready? The wheels on the bus go round and round, round and round, round and round. The wheels on the bus go round and round, all through the town. Stop that bus! Let's see who's getting on. Can you guys see? It's a bear. What do bears do this time of year in the winter? You remember? Yeah, you're right. They sleep. This bear is not sleeping, though, is he? He's walking there. Okay, let's see who else gets on the bus. Are you ready? The wheels on the bus go round and round, round and round, round and round. The wheels on the bus go round and round all through the town. Stop that bus, friends. We have someone else getting on. Oh, do you see? It's a little girl. A little girl and a bear. Those are our clues for our story today. Are you guys ready to listen? Let's shake all our sillies out. Put your hands up. Open, sharpen, open, sharpen. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open, sharpen. Them, open, shut them, put them in your lap. Then, then. Today's story is called Horrible Bear by Amy Dykeman. Hmm, I wonder why this bear is horrible. We're about to find out. Horrible Bear. Oh, there's the bear. Remember, what's he doing? Sleeping. Yeah. A little girl, there she is, peeked into the bear's cave. Can you guys see? What happened? Oh, it's her kite. It flew into the bear's cave. She needed to get it back, so she reached and reached to get her kite. But the bear rolled over. Look what happened to her kite. It broke. Horrible bear, the girl shouted. What'd she do? She woke him up. The girl stomped down the mountain. Horrible bear. The girl stomped through the meadow. Horrible bear. She stomped all the way home. Horrible bear. Bear was indignant. I'm not horrible, he said. She barged in. She made a ruckus. She woke me up. He, how would it, how would she like it if? Bear got an idea. It was a horrible bear idea. Bear practiced barging. Bear practiced making a ruckus. And he practiced waking someone up. Horrible bear, bat squeaked. Perfect, bear said. Bear stomped. Out of his cave. The girl stomped into her room. But she was too upset to take a nap, so the girl tried drawing. Horrible bear. She tried reading. Box. Horrible bears. She tried talking to the best 
listener she knew. That horrible bear. He broke my rip. Her stuffy couldn't listen as well as before. What fell off? Look, his ear accidentally ripped off. I didn't mean to, cried the girl. Oh. Meanwhile, the bear stomped down the mountain. Roar, roar, roar. He stomped through the meadow. Roar, roar, roar. He stomped right to the girl's front door. Roar! Which opened. And then it's the girl. I'm sorry, she said. And all the horrible went right out of the bear. Bear padded. He wiped. He got another idea. It was a sweet bear idea. Thank you, bear. She whispered, nobody fixed her stuffy's ear. She had a sweet bear idea, too. Bear and the girl skipped through the meadow. They bounced up the mountain. And together, they patched everything up, even the kite. Nothing was horrible at all. For the moment, you guys see, it's the goat. He's crunching on the kite. Uh-oh, trouble's coming. <laughs> this is a pretty fun book, isn't it? Guys, I'm showing you one of our new wonder books. A wonder book is an audio book that reads a story and you can follow along. So right here in the inside cover, you just turn the button on and then hit play. And welcome to Wonder Book. It talks to you. So I wanted to show you these new products that we have. So if you want to check it out, we have several. We have picture books. We have um, easy readers. We have quite a few options. So check out these new books. You can call the library and um, request them, and we'll bring them up to you. So my friends, that's it. Are you ready to sing goodbye? I got to turn my book off. Turn off. OK. Are you ready to sing goodbye to all of our friends with this? Goodbye, friends.